Hello boys and girls, welcome to today's modelled read. Our learning intention is that you are listening to a book being read with fluency and expression and you are learning to make predictions. So that's our reading strategy we're focusing on today, making predictions. Success criteria, I can apply fluency and expression when I read text and I can make predictions about a book based on what I can see and read. So you need a piece of paper. Go and grab a piece of paper and create three columns, before, during and after. Press pause and write that on your piece of paper now. Okay, predicting. Here is our text today. A wombat's picnic, a fraction dilemma. Okay, so this is our title page. This is the front cover of our book and we need to make some predictions about this book, what we think it will be about. Now we can use the words, so the title as well as the picture. Now predicting, readers use clues from the text and their own experiences to make predictions about what happened before, during and after the read. Okay, so we're going to do our first column, our before column. So having a think about the title, Wombat's Picnic, a fractions dilemma. Now dilemma means a problem, okay? So a fractions problem. So I can see that he's going to have a picnic and there might be a problem with perhaps having to share his bread. So I have written in my before column, I think this book is going to be about a wombat that has a picnic with bread and I've used the pictures. I can see he's on a picnic rug, I can see he's got a picnic basket and I can see he's got bread, okay? And my character is a wombat. I think he might have to share his bread and I've gained that prediction from the title, a fraction dilemma, a fraction problem, okay? And I also wrote that I think it might have fraction words in it like eighths and halves and quarters. So that's an important part of our predicting today as well to realize that perhaps some of the words that might be coming up in our text because that's what good readers do. All right, let's get stuck in. You need to press pause now and write your before column. Wombat's picnic, a fractions dilemma. One whole it's a lovely day and Wombat is heading to the river to have a peaceful picnic. He finds a perfect spot under a eucalyptus tree, lays down his rug and opens his lunch basket with delight. I have one whole damper to eat all by myself, Wombat says while settling down under the shade of a tree. So my prediction was right. But this is called damper and it's very similar to bread. Just then he hears one animal squeaking. G'day! It's Echidna. She's wandering out of the bushes. Oh, Wombat doesn't look very happy. Wombat glances at Echidna and then at his damper. Echidna sits next to Wombat and eyes the damper longingly. Wombat knows that he'll need to divide the damper. And we know divide means share. As there are two of us, would you like half of my damper? Wombat asked kindly. Oh yes please, replied Echidna. You are very nice for sharing, Wombat. Just then, they hear two animals chanting, G'day! G'day! It's two long-necked turtles. They are climbing up out of the river. Oh, look at Wombat's face again. Wombat glances at Echidna and the two long-necked turtles and then at his damper. Boys and girls, you now need to make your during prediction. So press pause in a second and you are going to write what you think is going to happen next. I have written in my during column, so this is during the read, in the middle of the read, I think he might have to share all of his damper and there won't be any left for him. Maybe the others might have something to share too. 
because I saw the long neck turtles were holding something. Hmm. Press pause now and write in your during column. The long neck turtles nestled down next to Wombat and eyed the damper longingly. Wombat knows he will need to divide the damper further. Now that there are four of us, would you like one quarter of my damper each? Wombat asked thoughtfully. Oh yes, please, they replied together. You are very nice for sharing, Wombat. Just then, they heard four animals chirping, G'day, 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 g'day. It's four galahs. They're fluttering down from the eucalyptus tree. Wombat glances at Echidna and the two long neck turtles and the four galahs. And then at his damper. The galahs, the galahs flop down next to Wombat and eye the damper longingly. Wombat knows that he'll need to divide the damper further again. Now that there are eight of us, would you like one eighth of my damper each? Wombat asked generously. Oh yes, they replied together. You are very nice for sharing, Wombat. Wombat cut the damper, dividing it equally into eight pieces. Oh. Wombat seems a bit disappointed. Wombat looks around nervously to see if anyone else is coming. He sits starting, uh, staring at one-eighth of his damper on his plate, looking forlorn. Mm, I remember that word, forlorn, in Thelma the Unicorn. <gasps> hey, kind wombat, Echidna squeaks, I have one lamington to share. <gasps> wombat smiles when he sees Echidna take out the yummy lamington. How can Echidna cut the lamington so that all the eight animals get an equal share? <gasps> hey, wonderful wombat, the long neck turtles chant. We have two sandwiches to share. Wombat grins when he sees the turtles take out the delicious sandwiches. <gasps> How can the long neck turtles cut the two sandwiches so that all eight animals get an equal share? Hey, generous wombat, the galahs chirped. We have four oranges to share. Wombat breams when he sees the galahs take out the juicy oranges, which means he gets excited. How can the galah cut the four oranges so that all eight animals get an equal share? Look at them having a wonderful feast. Uh-oh. Look who's turned up. Wombat is so happy. Hey, thanks, Echidna, the two long neck turtles, and the four galahs for sharing. What a feast for all of the animals to enjoy together. Okay, boys and girls, you need to do your after prediction now. Okay, the final column. And I've written in my after column, my predictions were right. The wombat was kind and shared his damper, but the other animals had things to share too. Press pause now and go and write in your after column and then upload it to Dojo.